Asset deflation, asset deflation, bingo, bingo, plutonic pluris, major asset deflation coming up in certain parts, certain parts asset inflation, right? And it really depends on uh, if they're gonna be bailing them out, if they're gonna be printing a shit ton of money, uh, because if they do that, then we're gonna see asset inflation. But I don't think we're gonna go high, they're gonna do that. Um, they need to keep tabs on uh, inflation. I mean, they, they put themselves in a hole, right, in a bind. Because Western world is collective at war with Russia and China, soon to be. And it's, it's sort of a, not on the forefront, but war drums not only pounding, they're making moves, right? The, the war has already begun with China. So any nation that wants to wage war, they have to have a solid currency. They can't have hyperinflation at the same time that they're waging war, right? And they have no room to maneuver right now. They can't lower interest rates because inflation, inflation is pretty high, right? And if they kill the supply chain coming out of China the way they killed resources coming out of Russia, you're going to see inflation go through the effing roof for certain products, right? Really. Like, just imagine what a price of a laptop is going to be if all of a sudden China's sanctioned. Just, just imagine. Or price of tubes for a tire. Because last I looked at this, I looked at this again. This is something that, I don't know if you want to say preppers, but people who, who realized what was coming were looking into. Uh, that's why cryptos came to be, right? But I looked into a lot of the stuff, what was coming out of China, what was the main products being that China basically had control of. From what I understand, almost 100% of tubes for tires comes from China. So if all of a sudden we've got sanctions going on China, all these people riding bikes, trying to reduce their carbon footprint, they're screwed, right? They blow a tire, they're done, right? And plastic has a certain shelf life, right? So if you need to get backups for your bikes, Go get your tires right now, extra. And if sanctions don't go up within five years, whatever it is, the plastic six years wears off and it's not, it doesn't have its integrity anymore, right? But it's, it's a fail safe. It's a, it's a it's sort of a safety net, right? And there's a lot of things that just come out of China, right? Medicine. Uh, start stocking up your, on your medicines, gang, right? Get your vitamin Cs, vitamin Ds, get your zincs, your uh, get stuff that do some research and find out. And we can do it in our guild, by the way. Maybe we should have a separate folder, uh, supplies, survival, something like this, to try to figure out what's made almost 100% in China, right? and what people need to stock up on uh, to protect ourselves from what's coming, what these technocratic World Economic Forum puppets want to do, which is basically uh, wage war, war three, because their whole economic model has collapsed and they want to introduce centrally backed digital currencies so they can control everything, i.e. make you a slave, right? Hold on to your gold and silver coins. Yeah, if you have them, yeah, good idea.